Here at the Technical Services Division, we've been asked the question about how to reduce the noise in PVC after it's been installed. Of course, if noise is a concern, we always recommend cast iron. Cast iron is the quietest material for the application. But what happens if you're stuck using PVC, but you still need for it to be quiet? Well, we don't know. And we couldn't find anyone who did. So we modified a display rig, and we're going to do some tests to find out. But before we do, it's important to recognize that we are not making any recommendation or warrant of quality. This is more like a scientific experiment. Sound is a difficult thing to measure. Objectively, the difference between the sound of fingers rubbing paper and a jet engine is many, many orders of magnitude. But that's not how people hear sounds. Even sounds of equal loudness are not heard in the same way. For every 10 decibel increase, the noise is perceived as twice as loud. In addition, the higher the frequencies in a sound, the more distressing it can be to the ear. <laughs> to simulate what a person would actually hear, we have set our mic up at one inch away from the pipe. The sounds that you will hear will come from this microphone, pass through this digital to audio converter, and be recorded on this computer. To get an accurate measurement, we will use this decibel meter. We are not going to adjust the mic gain during this test, so what you will hear is an apples to apples comparison. We are going to test both foam core and solid PVC. Before the installation test, we will use foam core as the base because it is the louder and more installed of the two materials. But enough details, let's flush. You can jump to the material you are most interested in or watch all of the tests in sequence. Thank <laughs> you. 